Welcome to 3 Threes Episode 1, a series where I break down a 3 star attack under 3 minutes and give you 3 important tips. So, now let's get into it. Today we have the Town Hall 11 Drag Bad. This is such a powerful attack strategy from Town Hall 11 and above. It's basically taking down the maximum splash from the base and getting good value with the dragons so the bats can then finish things off. This is not a spam attack so it requires practice and precise timings to pull triples consistently. The dragons can deal with most of the enemy clan castle troops so that's not an issue and the stone slammers are a really good option to back up the dragons and the clan castle balloons. They're gonna be taking down most of the enemy defenses so it's a really good option. You can also go with a battle blimp in some cases like a yeti bomb or like an electro dragon inside the blimp. You could do that but the stone slammer with the balloons are gonna be a really good option compared to the others. So once the splash is gone and the path is cut out, the bats they're gonna come in and clean up the base for the perfect 3 stars. Timing is really important with the bats and it can be really hard to master the free spell timing but with continuous practice it is easy to pull off. The heroes have an important role to create the path for the bats or for the dragons. It is not a must that you actually use your heroes every time to create pathing for your dragons. You can also use the heroes to make sure to take down the rest of the splash defenses to make sure you create a good pathing for your bats. The warden ability can be used on the early strikes from the eagle artillery to make sure you are protecting your dragons for the longest time possible so they get the maximum value from the base. And the bats are really quick, they can go ahead and clean up the base but they do struggle on taking down storage buildings so in that case taking a few minions, archers or even wizards can really help you out on time so you don't make a time fail especially with these kind of attacks. So now let's move on to the important tips. Tip number one. Make sure to funnel the dragons into the base to get the maximum value and this can be done by using your heroes or in this case the dragons themselves can be used to funnel. Tip number two, start the dragons from the area of maximum splash damage because they are a main threat to your batch. So taking down a multi inferno is a really good value from your dragons and it's a key target to take down in any kind of bat attacks. Tip number 3. Start the bats when they have a good path to move through the base. A bad pathing can make the bats just split around to multiple defenses and makes it really harder to freeze rift out splash damage defenses. So 